Josh. Hey, Amy. Hey, can you believe this? It's 1.30 on a Thursday and we're out of wine already. Are you sure? Yeah, I just checked them both. This is all I got out of two boxes of wine. Um, we just bought these. Well, I mean, we do drink wine pretty quickly though, but I mean, are you sure you're doing it right? Well, I don't know. We only just started buying boxed wine, but I think so. Okay, well, let's see. I don't know, Josh. These both feel like they still have stuff in them. But I'm using the tap and nothing's coming out. This is all I've gotten. Look at that. I mean, I'll drink it. Well, let's see. I think you're doing it wrong. Huh. Wrong? Yeah. Let me show you. Okay. So, if it's not coming out of the tap anymore, but it's still... Oh, I can even hear it. I can hear that there's stuff in there. Is it wine screaming out to be let out of the box? It is. Now, if this has happened to you, and you think you're out of box wine, well... We're definitely on that. We're going to let you in on a little secret. So, what you need to do, actually, is open the box up because there's secret wine hiding inside. That's right. Secret, secret wine? wine? Secret wine. You think, you think you might be out of wine? No. No. You are not out of wine yet. You will be soon. But, secret wine. Do you want to see how to find the secret wine? Is this the, but wait, there's more part of the offer? Yes. You but wait. The, there's more wine. All right. Do you want to see how to find the, the secret wine? Let's find the secret wine. All right. So there are a couple of ways you can do this. One, you can tilt the wine in a lot of different ways while trying to pour it into your glass to get out, but you still might leave some in the box. So what you want to do. Oh yeah. Look at that. Like it's that. working. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. This is uh -huh. working. There you go. So you can actually open up the boxes and then once you open it up, you can see that the, has the bag inside the box of wine. So we're gonna open up this box so you can actually pull the tab out here too, the tab. And you pull it out. Oh my gosh, look at all that wine in there. You were gonna throw that out. You didn't know it was in there. That reminds me of the time I gave blood. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, that's a visual I don't need. But let's see how much wine is actually in there. Do you wanna do it with this box? Sure. Well, wow, that's I'm a lot. Get, that's I know, a lot. it is. It really is. <laughs> I thought a lot. That, that one seemed like it really was empty, but it's like Christmas. It's, it's a surprise secret one. If we have a Christmas this year. We'll see. Let's get all this wine out. Look at that. Bonus wine. Oh my gosh, I heard angels singing when I pulled this out. And you kind of do have to move it around a little bit to make sure you're getting it all out. This is making me thirsty, Amy. <laughs> it should. We're going to have a lot of wine to drink because of all this bonus wine in the boxes. Oh my gosh, this is a that's, full glass. That's a lot. That's a lot of bonus secret wine right there. I'm just going to keep pouring, <laughs> even if it overflows. So. Now, I do want to say, I've, you know, I've tried to move this one around a lot, and I've gotten as much as I can out. There's still a teeny bit of wine here in the bag that I can't get out. If you're desperate, which you may be some days during COVID, you can just snip this with a pair of scissors and pour it directly into your mouth. I'm not going to do that, because that's going too far. But, but if, you, if you don't, then you'll, you'll find raccoons in your trash trying to drink your wine. By raccoons, I mean children. Mm -hmm. That happens. All right. Oh my gosh. That is a ton of wine in that one. This one didn't have quite so much. Let's try some so, more. Yeah, you'll be surprised. Okay, there's our beans. Okay, you try that one. We have another one here. Is that one empty? Yeah, this one's empty. All, all four are empty. We just admitted how much box wine we bought. For the purpose of this video. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not COVID. We will be donating and children this. At all. We'll be donating this to charity. Oh yeah, that one didn't have very much. So, it's always kind of a surprise. People, you're throwing away money. <laughs> this one had a ton. Looks like we have a lot of wine to drink. Oh, do we? It's a Bacchanalia. It's a full glass one. We could just settle down. <laughs> All right, so let's just show. I mean, this one maybe we tilted some to try to get it out in the past. That's why there's so little in there. But you can see 
the variety. I'm thinking. I, I'm getting some uh, ideas for uh, some good, like Secret Santa. <laughs> you know, everyone gets a leftover box, and depending on how much we drink, might be in there, we drink most of the box of wine. And yeah. yeah, I'm getting some like musical instrument. Like, let's play a song. Okay, not really. Not really want to. Oh wait. And we haven't even started drinking yet. And we're just already like playing music. All right. Okay. Well. So, our recycler will think we're alcoholics <laughs> or having a party. I swear we're, we're not, not having, having parties. Party. We're, we're, just party. we're just alcoholics. Yes. All right. Well, that is a The More You Know video from Food Banjo. Uh, I suspect if you're buying box wine, you already know about it. You this. probably <laughs> do. But if um, you're a newcomer to boxed wine, kind of like let this are. be a lesson. Yeah. And you know, the thing is, just to talk about boxed wine really briefly, like there are really good boxed wines out there. And the great thing is, you can just like have a glass here or there. You don't have to like worry about like you've opened a bottle of wine you need to drink in the next like two days or something. So boxed wines are great. For just being able to have a glass here and there and self-medicating yeah and um yeah just take a little or a lot just find a box of wine that you love and just buy a bunch of it like we it's... discovered this one and really like it which is why we have four now practically empty boxes of it uh, i should state like these are uh like one of these boxes the typical box holds th the equivalent of three bottles of wine um so uh, and it keeps it fresh for up to 30 days. You four. Oh, it's, oh, right. It is four. Mm-hmm. Yikes. Um, so this is 16 bottles of wine we have on the counter. Um, but, yeah, they keep, stay fresh for up to 30 days. So you can even have a couple brands out, a couple different uh, vintages, a couple different uh, grapes. Yeah, you have that you white, like. a rosé. Uh, have those out. Uh, yeah. And you don't have to worry about finishing a bottle in the night. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, well, or if you're going to open that second bottle, you have to worry about finishing that second bottle. Mm -hmm. that, that was a big worry we used to have. Yeah. All right. Well, let's drink some wine. Yeah. We've thanks. got a lot of thanks wine to drink the, now. Thanks for the tip. Oh, Amy. no problem. I, I, I really appreciate it. I can't believe you didn't know that already. All right. Well, thanks for joining us. Thank you. That was so much fun. Right. It's going to be even more fun. Thank you for visiting Food Banjo. Thanks for visiting Food Banjo. This one soon. is going to be mine. This will make COVID go by a little bit faster. Happy drinking. <laughs>